I see you've brought some friends, Rob. Yeah, well, just the local chapter of Drift Club Mexico. We thought we'd surprise you. There's more spectators than I expected for a secret club. Let's put on a bit of a show, then. Just turn it... Or just go straight down the stairs. This is Mr. Kenneth Rocks, Hooligan Gymkhana 10 Ford Focus RS RX. Two-litre, turbocharged, front-mounted engine and all-wheel drive. There's only the one seat, so... I will be the voice in your head. Guanajuato has something of a drift culture, you know. The tunnels, the narrow streets, the cathedral square. Roads are closed, right? Oh, yes. Our newest member, Pablo, organized it. straight down the stairs. This is Mr. Kenneth Locks, Hooligan Gymkhana 10 Ford Focus RS RX. Two-litre, turbocharged, front-mounted engine and all-wheel drive. There's only the one seat, so I will be the voice in your head. Guanajuato has something of a drift culture, you know. The tunnels, the narrow streets, the cathedral square. Roads are closed, right? Oh, yes. Our newest member, Pablo, organized it. Watch the walls, they're snaggy. <laughs> left, left hand fork. Coming up on the end, and a peek at the future of drifting. I've got a bit of a confession. You see, we've got another car for you to have a look at. Is... is that what I think it is? 
The RTR Ford Mustang Mach-E 1400, the first fully electric drift and Gymkhana platform. Should we take it out for a bit of a spin? This car was customised by drift legend and engineering wizard Mr Vaughan Gitton Jr and the fine people at RTR. Why? To answer that age-old question, what is the future of controlled oversteer? What's up, Rob? Looks like you two are having a lot of fun with that car. Oh, yes. Vaughn, it's quite a piece of work. Could I perhaps press you for your impressions working on it? For the members. Getting behind the wheel of the Ford Mustang Mach-E 1400 completely changed my perspective on what power and torque can be. Together, my team at RTR Vehicles and Ford Performance spent over 10,000 hours working collaboratively on this to bridge the gap between what people believe an electric car can do and what it can actually do. Turns out, it is well beyond my wildest expectations. The Mustang Mach-E 1400 uses seven motors, three on the front differential and four on the rear, giving us 1,400 horsepower so we can do anything from drifting to high-speed track racing. Every piece of aero and every duct you see is functional for aerodynamics and cooling. This car makes 2,300 pounds of downforce at 160 miles per hour. Ford has made it clear that they are bringing fun and function to the battery electric vehicle space, and this is just the start. I've watched even the most seasoned vets turn into giggly little kids behind the wheel and in the passenger seat of this wild machine. So, mission accomplished. We're almost at the end, but as you've noticed, we've been running in all-wheel drive mode with all seven motors. So, for the next bit, let's try something different. That was all-wheel drive. The motor layout allows you to change drivetrain, essentially, at the push of a button. So, just toggle it over from all-wheel drive into rear-wheel drive, shutting down the front motors, and then off we go. The fastest drivetrain swap you will ever do. Right-left opportunity ahead. Careful as you manage the inertia transfer. <laughs> 